Another medication that can be taken by both men and women is minoxidil. And minoxidil is a medication that was originally developed for high blood pressure. It's topically applied and they applied this to the scalp. And I think they had a lot of the um, study subjects that were men that were bald and they had high blood pressure. And, they, and you spray it on the skin of the scalp. The idea here is what it is, it's a vasodilator. So it locally causes little small blood vessels to get bigger. And therefore, if you think of your body as a closed system where there's pressure building up, if you can divert some of that pressure into these blood vessels now that are filling up in your scalp, then you have a lower central blood pressure. It didn't work very well for blood pressure, but they noticed that these study participants started to have more hair growth, that their hair started to grow again. And so they you know, studied this and they figured, hey, this is great because we are allowing more oxygen to get to the hair follicle again. We're allowing more nutrients to get there. The hair follicle becomes healthier, stronger again, and the hair is growing again. That's how this works. The downside of these things is, of course, if you stop the minoxidil, the hair will fall out again. It's a very you know, short-term reward.